Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I just wanted to come on here to share with you guys another haul. Um, this one is from your dollar store with more and I did this haul quite a few weeks ago, maybe even a month ago and I'm just getting around to filming it. So yeah, I'm just going to get into this and show you guys what I got. So the first thing I picked up was a set of clear stamps. Um, this was, I believe, yeah, two dollars and there are these beautiful faces like look at the hair and the detail in the faces they remind me of the Jane Davenport um, stamps that I've seen at Michael's but obviously for a lot cheaper so I figured I would pick one of these up just to play around with um, I did pick up from Michael's um, some Tombow skin color markers so I would love to try that with these stamps so I picked that one up I also picked up this set of looks like sunflower stamps um, and I just really like that. This was also two dollars so I picked that up. I picked up three of these double-sided tapes and as you can see they're quite thick. Um, they are 0.6 inches so this is the definitely the widest width that I've seen and these were only $1.25 so I grabbed these, um, they're just great. I really, really like using these for projects. I picked up another thing of these um, wooden spools and my plan is to use these for washi tape samples in Happy Mail. So I already have one pack and I just decided I would go ahead and pick up another one. And this, uh, because it doesn't have a sticker on it, I believe was a dollar. I picked up these um, buttons, these, oh my god, they had the cutest little designs. These were um, $2 a pack, and you get three, four, five, so six, and this one is called In the Desert, so just really cute little cacti, and like, look at the detail. They're so dimensional, or three-dimensional. I picked that one up. I also picked up this donut party one, so you get five donuts and I just love how they look they're so much fun and um, oh this one doesn't come with the actual button which is great because I was planning on cutting them off anyways so I got that one and then I got the forest babies so these are um, all the woodland animals and I just thought for fall projects this would be perfect and this was also two dollars and I've seen so many people um, shopping at Hobby Lobby and getting such great deals like these little buttons I think were 75 cents and I'm oh, so so jealous because honestly I could have bought them all they're just so pretty so I got that I picked up this bottle of glitter glue this was $1.25 and I just really like the chunky glitter there's like whites and golds in there so I thought that was cute just to kind of I know it's glue, but I'm going to try, like if I paint uh, something wooden, like do a wooden project, um, I want to try painting this over and kind of letting it dry and see how that works. If it dries really tacky, then I might have to seal it with something. And then I just went ahead and picked up this one, and this is just all gold. But they're so pretty. And this is also $1.25. And then last but not least, I picked up... Um, this cotton candy uh, bottle of paint and this is the only store that I see have all the colors of acrylic paint I've been to like my Dollar Tree my Dollaramas and no one seems to be restocking they had like almost every color um, and the reason I picked this up I actually picked up six bottles of it um, was that I actually changed my colors of my um, craft like storage and organization um, to pink and purple so I um, wanted to alter the photo boxes that I had uh, because I've been to Michael's quite a few times and I haven't been able to um, buy a pink box like this so I think I'm just gonna buy the plain craft color and paint it myself I ended up doing that um, to get the purple that I wanted and I just bought purple paint and it came out all right. Um, the only thing I don't like is that it's very chalky, so it doesn't have really like a smooth finish, but um, 
it works and it's a lot cheaper than you know buying the boxes or trying to look for these patterns um, or colors that you want so that's what I'm gonna do with those um, however I did see these really pretty photo boxes that were purple white and black and they had really pretty florals so now I'm debating oh my gosh if I don't want pink at all and just want all purple because I seem to be really into purple so I'm gonna have to make up my mind um, I bought some of those lacy um, Dollar Tree containers like the light light pink and I thought that that's what I liked but anyways I don't know I'm gonna have to make up my mind so yeah that's everything that I picked up from your dollar store with more thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one bye